Hey gang, doing a live stream here, and this is Captain Cowboy. So, I received a little comment just now that says, What does an airship wrench do? What is it? Well, honey, let me tell you something, okay? The biggest misconception about airships is airship wrenches. So, let's go ahead and take a look at the airship wrench. And what it does. So, if you scroll down to like the bottom of your airship skills, you will notice that there are four skills with a little lock. I have the airship level requirements, but I do not have the necessary scroll in order to unlock it. I don't even think you can buy these anymore. Like, this is some old stuff. Um, let me go back here. So basically, there's four different skills and they're all amazing types of skills like this one gives you extra troop damage and kills it increases the amount of troops that you kill and does more damage this one playing out increases your troop attack and then on your guardian side um it increases your boo beast uh loot bonus by 10 percent um and then this one increases your troop defense by 2%. So what does this mean? How do I get these scrolls? And what can I do for it? So basically, you could pick it up in the catacombs. You cannot buy it in the catacombs trader. No, you have to outright pick it up. Um, and then you could go to your items. And I'm pretty sure I have some of them. Um, you'll notice that I don't use them. More on that in a little bit. I'm just right now trying to explain to you what it is, how does it impact you, and why do we have it, why do I not have it. So let's scroll down and try to find this. All right, so you'll notice here I have five of the Flying Fortress, and I need 500 to unlock the scroll. Then as far as the wrenches go, I don't think I have, oh, I have 500 wrenches. So you use the wrenches to upgrade it, the ability to another level. You'll notice I have 530, still haven't unlocked any of them. Cap, what are you doing? Why are you so bad? Why haven't you done this? Because let me tell you, those four abilities were cool and all when airship level 60 was the highest level there was. Uh, they unlocked a airship level 70, changed the game. What they did was they also increased the maximum level of an airship ability to 31. They also came out with an additional stat that comes along with getting your uh, skill past level 21. So once I got past level 21, this skill gained distance damage. Now with my level being above 30, uh, being above 21, I also gained 25% distance damage. So with that being said, these stats have caught well first of all that back in king of avalon you had to buy these and in order to get level one or like level five i think level five costs about ten thousand dollars each so you're talking forty grand forty thousand dollars us dollars in order to get this only to get like three or four percent but all of the big players are doing it the big players are doing it because they wanted that extra percentage but now with uh your skills going up to level 31 there was absolutely zero, zero usage for these. These are actually decreasing your skills if you put them in above your other skills. Now, granted, you could go ahead and put this in and remove, like, so let's say you start a march. These are my abilities. You start a march, and then I want to go ahead and put in extra damage and troop kills and uh, take out my march capacity because my march capacity isn't giving me any actual troop bonuses or stats, I'm actually going to gain some stats there. But is that worth the cost? Is that worth um is that, you know, worth the necessity and the time and everything else that comes along with it? No. 0% not worth it. Um it's a waste of money, it's a waste of your time, it's a waste of your rewards from the catacombs. Um I highly discourage anyone anyone from getting it. Um I don't even think the game really wants anyone to get it. It's just there because 
it would probably be too difficult um, to take it off. And I'm sure that there's someone who's still spending money trying to attain those. So that's why they keep them around because someone doesn't know what they're doing. Yoon, <coughs> um, buddy from, not a buddy, um, a horrible human being from King of Avalon that I used to play with. Um, I don't know why, but he's one of the few that actually uses them now. Um, yeah, he actually just killed Hedy, Hedy, I don't know. He killed Hedy from King of Avalon. He was like one of the biggest players in King of Avalon. Killed him in UAC. Um, dropped Hedy a lot of power. Um, I think like a billion power in one march. Uh, I got a screenshot from a friend who's still in that kingdom. Don't know why they're in that kingdom. He's a terrible human being. I hope he dies in real life. Um, yeah, that was a little bit too far. Too far, I do have to admit. Um, but the point still stands. I highly discourage anyone, and I mean anyone, from wasting their time on those advanced abilities. Do not use your airship wrenches. Whatever. Um, I thank you all for watching this video. This is Captain Cowboy. Take care.